What's going on, boys? Asian sensation here, back with another banger. Today we are doing something very special, something I don't think I've ever done on this channel, and what that is going to be is a best of five Cobra against my boy Deez Nuts. Deez Nuts is referred to as he. Oh, uh, I guess he just goes Cobra a lot, as do I though. Now, recently I just love been going, or I've loved going Cobra. I don't know why. I think it's just more entertaining, and uh, after playing this game for years, you know, it's fun to just mix it up, but uh, let's go ahead and sauce him the code real quick, and I'll see you guys when we start. We're going to start with the offside, and then loser picks next map. Let's get it. Alrighty. So now I, I gotta figure out what maps I wanna choose for um, if I lose. We're at 50%. Nice, I can unplug my phone. Freaking poggers, boys. Okay, so my boy DZ's getting in here. I don't know what Cobra strat I'm gonna go on offside. I'm trying to think. Um, I'm gonna tell him no NG as well. No NG, cause yeah, I don't really wanna play against Cobra, Ninja NG or some BS like that. All right, toss him the code. Let's get right into it. Also, if you guys are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. Uh, we're on our way to 40k subs. So uh, if, you, if you enjoy the content, be sure to hit that subscribe button. We've been posting daily content every day this summer. It's been a litty time. So let's freaking go, boys. All right. So I'll see you guys when D's Nuts joins our lobby, I guess. There we go, baby. Look at that clickbaitable uh, thing. But I can't clickbait him because I have to use this weird thumbnail. Okay, so... Tier zero, of course, I'm gonna let him know. All right, so let's go ahead and, um, I'm gonna go ahead and we'll go like that. We're gonna go like, where's my track powers? Boom, boom. All right, so let me see what I wanna go. I think I'm gonna go bomb mortar. I think I'm gonna go bomb mortar, boys. Um, is there anything else I could go? I mean, I honestly, dart would be decent. Um, yeah, I'm just going to rock this. Good luck. Have fun. And if he doesn't have tier zero powers, obviously we will re redo, but he knows better than he knows me better than that. So let's freaking go. This should be a GG. I'm excited. Should be some quality content. You know what I'm saying? So let's get the Cobras going, boys. Gonna be very similar starts. So yeah, I don't know exactly how I'm gonna play this, um, but I probably plan on starting the Bloom Respect round 18 or so. And my guess is whenever someone rushes, it's gonna result in an immediate counter. We'll have to see though. And that, those games are usually really intense. So I'm looking forward to it. I'm gonna go 257 Eco. Now we save up for a Mortar. Should afford it dang near perfectly here in a moment at 42 seconds game time. He's doing the same thing. We both send seven sets of eco with two wired funds and we can still afford our mortar. I'm gonna hide mine in this top right corner. Perfect. Splendid, boys. So we're gonna nearly know I was offset a few leaks here, but that's fine. Let's move our mortar back here now and go back to ecoing. So these nuts, after playing him a bunch of times, I've realized he plays very eco heavy with Cobra and he won't really bloom just spent round 16 like some passive, uh, passive ecoers do with Cobra. And so yeah, I'll probably start blue nursing around six or around 18, most likely. It's gonna depend on how this game plays out. Okay, I'm gonna get the rapid reload here. So we have separate, uh, we have differing, differing mortar placements here in terms of our path. I like mine more towards the beginning, just so I have more time to react in case I need to move my mortar, you know? But yeah, we're just gonna be max ecoing. He's doing the same. Our ecos are di literally identical, I would bet, because we've both been sending the same stuff for the whole game. So that's that. I'll probably set him a decent amount of blacks on round six just to force the Bernie stuff as well as potentially more defense. We'll just have to see how he plays it out. So he does have spikes. Okay. So he does have his tier zero powers. We love that. All right. I'm going to go ahead and get another Cobra down. And what we're going to do, we're going to go straight into some black balloons here. And I think we can handle greens as it is for a little bit here. I'm going to send him this and he might send me some blacks here in a sec. I'm going to go for my Bernie stuff now. And we're gonna move that up top. He's used two sets of spikes. So that's 40 lives eaten up by his spikes right there. So if he didn't, if he would not have spiked, he would have leaked um, down to 88 lives, but now 84 lives. So that's that. All right, we're just gonna keep on eco in here. He's got slightly more eco than us, but that is not a big deal at all. So 
I, I think it's very, very even so far. Should be a good game. I'm guessing it'll end in the mid-round 20s, if I'm going to be honest. If I had to guess a round that it would end, that would be it. So I, I'm guessing he has bomb as well. I don't know why. I just feel like he's going to have bomb. Uh, he seems like a bomb guy. I'm pretty sure he is. He, he introduced me to sub bomb Cobra on Frozen River, which is actually pretty good strat. And it's fun to use, definitely, because no one really uses it. But it's a very unique and effective as well. So he stopped equaling. I'm going to 550. I'm playing this very eco heavy. He's probably close to about 500 eco. He might go for some yellows here though. We'll see. And he's sending whites, I believe. Let's just mortar micro that a little bit to prevent leaks. He might send region leads can be very effective against uh, Cobra players. So I'm getting my Cobra army up. All of them are on strong. That's what you want to do. Unless you're trying to pop a frick, or if you're trying to misdirect a BFB or something and you don't want your Cobras hitting it, then obviously you would change your targeting to like last or something, but let's just go for that here. Let's get the signal flare rolling. I'm going to get the bigger blast as well. And now I'm going to go for a tiny rush here just to spook him. Now let's see if we can do any damage here. I'm guessing he's just going to get up a cluster ASAP. Let's see if that's easy reads. That is easy reads. Perfect boys. And he just went for an extra range bomb and it handled really well. So well done. I got some nice eco out of that. And he has a little bit more wired funds than us, but we have a little more eco than him. So it kind of is a little trade off here. We're going to go for our if we're recording. Nice. We are. Love to see it, boys. It's currently 10.52 p.m., but we're vibing, boys. This, this beats free power-ups any day, but I hope you guys did enjoy that bonus clip. That was probably one of my best bonus clips of all time. I, I didn't mean to send that of all time. All right. So let's just keep on spamming these fellas. I think he might blooners me around 16, if I'm going to be honest which is not like him. We'll see if he does. If he does, we're gonna need at least a cluster. At least a cluster. Is he starting the blue spend? He is not, he's still wired fun spamming. As am I, obviously. Okay, let's make sure our mortar, this is a good spot right there. He's spiking the end. I wanna save my spikes. I'm gonna space eco a little bit. And I'm, I'm guessing we're both gonna start blue adjustment here. I like that we're going the same loadout. That's always fun. So let's go ahead and balloon adjustment him. Is he going to match it or is he going to play defensive and defend before he starts balloon adjustment? Nope, he's going to start balloon adjustment as well. So he has a lot more balloon adjustments than me. So our side's going to be a little bit more chaotic. It's not the worst thing in the world though, boys, because we are chilling. We have our Cobra on strong. All our Cobras on strong should help us out. Plus we have spikes. We need a mortar micro this. Oh my God. All right. We need a mortar micro that. Let's go ahead and spike this. All right, this is not good. We're chilling, we're chilling. Um, I think I need a balloon impact soon. He's gonna balloon boost something at me. Is that, a, what is he balloon boosting? We're fine against whatever he's balloon boosting. So I like like that. All right, I need to get a freaking uh, balloon impact here. Not what I wanna do, man. All right. We're chilling, but I had to sell a bunch of stuff. So he's outplaying us right now. We need to catch up in the balloon. Just... I'm dead. I don't know how a camo ceramic got through our defense. That's really unfortunate. Okay. That's so unlucky, man. I, if I had one spike, I'd defend that, but unlucky. I don't know how that gets past my mortar. I guess I need two mortars. That's so unlucky, man. GG, well played. Okay. Um, I kind of want to go Snowy Castle, maybe. Yeah, I'm going to pick Snowy Castle. And we're going to, I don't know what I'm going to do for a loadout here. We're going to go this Buccaneer Wiz, potentially. Let me think this one through. Either this, he's probably going to go sub bomb. Now I could do that as well. Um, hmm. Let's go sub. Let's go sub for sure. Now for our third, I might go glue. Also, it just put on Super Eco Boost. Like, come on, Bruno and Lockie, what are you doing, buddy? So, third tower. I could try glue, but I don't know if we're going to handle adjustment very well with that. So, let's see. Ninja, maybe. Chipper, maybe, actually. I'm going to try Chipper. I don't know how well this is going to go. I really don't. Bomb probably is a better call, but this is kind of more fun, in my opinion. So, we're going to try her out. Good try your out, eh? So I'm going to start off with a sub. Since our group popping power is absolutely horrible without an air burst. So I'm going to place this baby down. Rah her. 
and he's very shocked. But the, I have to do this because if he's gonna send me stuff, I need an airburst start to defend group balloons. Like, that's just how it is. I mean, I could go for a one one, but it's much more effective to just go for a zero two airburst. So we'll get that up at forty two seconds game time and roll from there. He's probably gonna bomb. I'm guessing he's gonna pull out bomb. I'm guessing he went sub cobra bomb knowing this guy as a player that would be my best guess no he's actually bringing the mortar he is bringing the mortar so probably has bomb as his third though probably has bomb as his third so we're gonna be ecoing pretty heavily playing this more so i'll probably go to about 400 eco before i start getting any cobras going and we're gonna go from there so let's just keep ecoing. Our eco's great. About 300 going around four. Can't really ask for anything much more than that. And okay. So we're going to need something for round six other than one airburst start. I'll probably go for another zero one uh, sub, I'm guessing. We'll see. We'll see. But yeah. Last game, I guess I just didn't get as many balloon response as him as quickly, and I, somehow a camo ceramic snuck by, and I didn't have any time to defend that, sadly, but it's too late when I saw it. it. Is what it is, though. So yeah, we're both max ecoing. Our ecos are identical thus far. He has two wired funds, though. He's probably gonna bloom those greens at me on this next round. I wouldn't be surprised at all. And I might burn a boost. We'll see. I'm gonna go for that right now. I'll put a spike as well at the end. All right, and now we're gonna space eco. Not, so he's not bloom boosting, so I think we can handle for a little bit. We'll just have to kind of play it by ear though. Let's see. Uh, I'm gonna go for a one one. I'm gonna go for a one one. Actually, I'm gonna tank the, yeah, I'm gonna go for the one one. I lied, we're doing it. So I'm just gonna chill with this. This should be good till round 10, unless he's super aggro around eight with yellows. But I'm gonna go ahead and start Cobra spamming. Not even spamming, I guess just getting up Cobras. We're going to space equal at the same time. Now, our defense, or our loadout, should handle Bloon Respect pretty well with a reactor and some 2-0 chippers next to it. I think this is going to be pretty solid. We'll have to see, though. It's all going to be dependent on how he uh, reacts with his Bloon Respect or anything like that, because he could also send us like a round 18 BFB, and that would be very troublesome. So we have to be cautious for things such as that. All right, uh, I'm going to boost if he goes for a huge yellow rush. I don't think he will. He's sending whites, which is not as effective. You're burning $15 per cent of that um, without getting any extra eco, just saying. Because it's it gives you the same eco as sending a set of yellows, and you can see the prices on the left. So for the leads here, we're going to get up a chipper. I don't really want to do that, but here we are going to do that. All right see if he's surprised by that now he's just gonna swag all right nice is he gonna rush round 11 he is not all right so we're gonna start to get up our monkey sub this is gonna be our reactor we're gonna get that up asap and then so he has a lot more wired funds than us let's just point that out we'll get that going all right i'm gonna go to 500 eco so he has way more wired funds than us this is not good my defense is just much more expensive than his so that's just kind of that, but we'll slowly catch up, slowly. Because he's going to need defense sooner than late. Actually, no, he's not. Mortar is just so freaking good. Mortar is one of the most balanced towers in the game, though. I want to be honest. I feel like it is one of the most balanced towers in the game. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I th I'd say the monkey subs up there, too. So that's nice. So yeah, we're just going to be spamming our 1-0 cobras um eventually a camel ceramic is gonna get by our reactor so we're gonna have to need to get up another submergent support probably so he has like 15 wire funds we have like half that uh that's not good i'm just gonna bloom boost this we're gonna see what he does i want to force some defense bro for cheap all right there we go that's fine we forced a cluster now, like I said, we'll handle balloon adjustment somewhat well. We really will. He just sold something. He might go for a round 18 BFB, dude. He really might. And we have... What did he just send? A Moab, okay. So we're just going to triple spike that, or double spike that, and we're fine. Perfect. There we go. Easy freaking claps. So he just had an offensive push there, and now he's starting the balloon adjustment process. So what I'm going to do is we're going to give another 2-0 chipper. 
and we're going to start spamming a few more Cobras in the process. I can't really afford to Bloom Dressman him yet. I need to focus on my side. So I think on round 20, I'm going to start the Bloom Adjustment. So one more Wired Funds, and then, yeah, this is all we're going to do for Wired Funds. Now we're going to save up around, okay, he might have just sent me a BFP. He might have just sent me a BFP. If he did, I'll probably try defending on boost with, by selling a couple Cobras. I, no, I think he just used all his money on adjustments. I could be mistaken, though. Okay. Well, we're handling his Bloom Adjustment, and look how many Cobras he has up to Bloom Adjustment. So that's pretty impressive on our side. This is why I brought this loadout. So we're going to start our Bloom Adjustmenting towards his side here. And I can't get up that many yet, but we'll get a bunch of money at the end of this round. Perfect. Splendid, boys. So nothing's got past our reactor in terms of camos. That's great. And now, given our live count, we can leak a whole camo ceramic this time around. So that's good. He's struggling. He is struggling. He needs a balloon impact. I'm struggling start a little bit here, but we're going to nearly know I've lost that. Okay, I can still leak a full ceramic. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He hits the wrong tower boost. He does survive. Gets up a second signal flare. He's going to need to get up a balloon impact here shortly. So this is going great for us, boys. This is literally perfect now. He sold something. He might be sending me a BP. Or not. He's going to need a balloon impact here. 100%. There is the balloon impact. Is it going to be enough? The regrows are going to be regrowing a lot. We're handling. I need one more chipper. Definitely. So let's sell that, actually. and get it to 2-0. And we still can leak a full ceramic. I love this, boys. Okay. So I'm pretty sure he has a misdirection, if I'm not mis- Oh, he's dead? He needs to boost that again, yeah? No, well played, well played. All right, so this is crazy. This is really crazy. I'll send him a few leads here. No camo ceramics are leaking through. I l love this, boys. I don't want to jinx it, though. He might go for an all-out here, and if he does, he just- He keeps accidentally hitting the wrong boost, I think. <laughs> been there before unless he is all outing we can defend we can sell everything get up a uh, first strike but there is a okay we oh shit okay we're chilling we're chilling chilling like a villain uh we're actually gonna do this i'm gonna boost that all right, and so those, so that. Come on, please defend, bro. Please, man. Uh, shit, shit, shit. Dude, I choked. I should have just countered. I'm so stupid, bro. I'm so f stupid. Oh my god, I'm so dumb bro like are you kidding me ay 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 all right i'm picking swan lake good luck have fun i'm so tilted bro i'm so tilted all i had to do is fucking counter it's that easy i should have just chipper stalled and countered but i'm trying to get some cool bonus clip footage yeah yeah get carried away i mean these are great games though so at the end of the day, I can't really complain. So it is what it is. We can still bounce back. We're doing a best of five. I'm guessing we're going to go same loadout on this map. I'd be surprised if uh, we're not. But yeah, I'm going to start off some Globras down here. We'll get up a couple of these right here. Put them both on strong. All right. Wow. I'm just going to toss some noobs. That was a big oops on my part, bro. I choked that so hard. Holy. You'd see it, but here's what it is. We bounce back, boys. Last game took an L, but tonight we're bouncing back. Let's get it. So we're chilling with this. I don't need to get up a grape shot yet. I'm curious to see. He's probably got Wiz as his third, I would imagine. It'd make the most sense. That's what people would do on Shallow River. That's what I would do on this map as well if I knew my opponent was going Cobra. So that's why we're doing it. <laughs> All right. He does not have his grape shot up yet, so he's going to leak a little bit here. That is facts. And we're going to need to get up a 
Okay, I'm going to play this really adjustment heavy, I think. I think I'm going to alter my play style from previous games. So we're going to play this really uh, uh, adjustment heavy. So we're not going to get as much eco, probably in the 400s, as opposed to the 600s. All right, so yep, I'm just going to be space ecoing here for a while. He's chilling with what he's got. I'm chilling with what I got. I'm going to start to get up a few Cobras here. Perfect. So yeah, a little bit different. Hopefully, I uh, cannot not afford that before the round starts. This feels bad. But I'll send him... Okay, I'm going to send him some greens on this next round. Just to force more than his current events. I'm probably going to balloon boost it at him as well. So yeah, that's going to be our plan of action here. We haven't really leaked at all to his, his eco balloon, so that's great. I'm going to balloon boost this. Now, he might do the same to us. We'll see, we'll see. But yeah, I'm going to send this. Yep, he's going to boost, actually. Just a boost. We're going to put our grip shot on first now just to help out with our leaks here. There we go. We're chilling, chilling. Great. So now the Cobra spam is going to begin. We'll be space ecoing until round 10. We'll get over 400 eco. If he goes aggressive round 8 yellows, I'm boosting. That's going to be what we do. Are we recording? Let's go. Yo, oh, you fool. You freaking love to see it, bro. All right. So, if we do win this game, I'm probably going to split this into two videos. Just going to say that, boys, right now. We'll see, though. <laughs> I got to win this game first. I'm not trying to get swept here, but if we do get swept, it is what it is. You know? It's still fun. It's so. It, this is so much better than free power-ups. I can't stress that enough. All right, so we have six wired funds. He has six as well. Well played. I'm just going to chill with 420 eco, boys. Now, the interesting part is going to happen round 10. We're going to see if he has wizard or if he has boomador. He does have the boomador. Okay, that, chain, that makes things spicy, boys. That's spicy. All right, he's very surprised. I'm going to swag on him because I think wiz is the better call. If you're doing Cobra v. Cobra on this map. TBH. Alright. Uh, we're going to send him a camo rush on this next round. Not a huge camo rush, but we are going to send him a camo rush. So we're going to send him this, followed by this. Let's get up the camo lead detection. If he does all out, we just have to micro really hard and somehow defend, please. I don't want to die to an all out round 13. I'm going to go straight for... No, I'm not going to go for my lightning. He's not rushing me yet. He... Oh. All right, very odd rush, but we're chilling. He tried to spook me there and get me to sell a lot, but I don't think I sold like anything, so we're chilling. Love to see it. He just spiked that. Okay, I'm just gonna make use up that spike. Good enough. All righty. So, he just sold that? What? What the heck? What's happening? Oh my god. What is happening? What was that? He's got a turbo charge that he took a gamble. He does get off the turbo. Uh, this just turned into a drain game, boys. This just turned into a drain. What is happening? What is this game, man? This just turned into a drain game. This is crazy. Is he gonna turbo this? This is crazy. All right, I guess I start spamming adjustments again. I don't, or wired funds. He has zero Cobras now. What is happening? We don't have camera detection on our destroy it ores. He boosted and spiked. We can expect an all out ensuing here any second now. Don't know if that's the right way to use ensuing. Don't care. This is intense. Trying to focus up, boys. Is he going to rush all out here? Um, I'm going to triple spike if he sends me a Moab. I think he did. I'm going to predict the Moab here, so we're going to triple spike. And then just get up another destroyer. This should solo Moab, even if it's balloon boosted. Is it easy reads? It is not. He did not send a Moab. Okay. <laughs> Unlucky. All right. All right. We're chilling. We're chilling. So I'm going to get up another Wiz up top here. Just a 0-1, just to help with AI LEDs. So he can't send me LEDs and mess everything up, since our other wizard is so far below the uh, original path. All right. So he's space equaling right now. This is really strange. I don't know if he has the money to defend an all-out next round. I will, I'm going to be honest. 
I don't think he does. And he might be thinking the same thing as me. So we'll see. We'll see. He might rush me with something. But I have three destroyers, bro. He only has one. We have triple the Moab Poppin' Power Sim currently. So, I don't know. He just went for that. I'm still going to Cobra Spam, bro. He's space ecoing. I guess I'll get up a little bit of eco because he is out ecoing us. So let's do that. But we have, we have more defense than him. So that's something we do have going for us. And he is kind of low on lives. So I'm going to send him one set of camo leads here. Now, this could honestly kill him. I'm not going to cap, boys. All right. He, oh, he's offensive pushing. Look at that bottom left. Bottom left of his side, he is potentially offensive pushing. We have to be wary of that. It's not yet because he would have the double lasers, the dual wheel lasers, if it was. So that's a 3x. He just sold it. Okay, okay. I'm countering if he all outs this time. I'm not going to make the same mistake twice. Now, I think I'm going to all out him on this next round. He might be thinking the same thing. So I'm going to get ready to boat pull if that is the case. Let's go ahead and let's do this. I'll get up another destroyer. That's no problem. Glaive Lord. Very interesting play. Now, I haven't even thought about Bloom adjustmenting him. I really haven't. I've been playing this more so like my Cobras are farms. And just kind of my side piggy bank that I can take from any time I want to sell one of these Cobra bitches. We get 660. Easy. He sold that? Uh, okay, it's because he has a Glaive Lord. That's fine. Now, I think I all out him on this next round, boys. I'm going to all out him. And it's a risk I'm willing to take. If he defends with fantastic micro, then well freaking done. Well freaking done. Props to you, DZ nutties. But we're going to have to just wait and see. Now, can I still have all my boosts? I'm probably just going to boost. Actually, not going to boost ASAP. We might boost AI, though. So yeah, I'm going to all out him. All out Moabs or BFBs with Moabs over the top with rainbows over the top. Actually, maybe not rainbows. We'll see. We'll see. But yeah, we're going for it. Is he going to counter? That is the question. All right, we're going to start the Moabs over the top. Boom. Please defend. G oh, wait, not defend. Don't defend. I think this is going to be a GG. We're going to have to see if these nuts can defend. He's getting up the turbos at the end. Is it enough? It looks too late, though. It's going to be a GG, boys. All right, so that is part one of the video. Tomorrow's vid or the next day will be the following part of this series. I hope you did enjoy. Remember, drop a like below. Hit that subscribe button, please. Hashtag Router40K. Let's get it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.